right now. Really good game we have on track here. West Dallas Hale has been winning pretty much the whole game. We got 12.47 remaining here in this game. So it looks to be, it's going to be rebounded in by Hale. Danny Steskunas once again taking it up the court. <clears throat> he dumped it off to Dijon Graf, back to Steskunas, then back to Graf. Now back, now to Owen Littell. Littell trying to drive in. And he's fouled. Possession will stay with West Dallas Hale. Passing in. Oh, wow. That was interesting there. So here's what happened. He, he passed the ball in, but he took one step back and ended up being a backcourt violation, being right near the middle of the court. So now Wawatosa will get the ball. Exactly what Wawatosa needed, actually. So now taking up the court is Jake Hansen. To Kai Rogers, he goes back to Hansen. Nice shot from the corner. There goes Hansen. He's on fire, 37-33. Now a four-point game. We'll take another timeout here. I think now it's going to be taken by Hale. Yep. So now a four-point game here in Wauwatosa. 30-second time. Have you always wanted to be a sports broadcaster but didn't know how to get started? Well, Game Mike allows you to go out and practice, just like we need to practice as athletes. You can't get better without work, so gain that experience on Game Mike. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Wauwatosa, Wisconsin, in the Milwaukee suburb here. We got a 37-33 game on hands here. Dan Steskunas. Boy, he says his name a lot of times. Taking it up. Ooh, nice pass there. Now in the corner, you got the Dijon Groff back to Robert Peters. Robert Peters, that ultimate leader on this team. There goes Dan Steskunas trying to turn around. Peters for the three-point line. There you go, Peters. 40-33 lead now. Robert Peters for West Dallas Hale. Dijon. Cole Hansen take it up now for West Dallas Hale. Back. Ooh. This will be a foul on. Foul on West Dallas Hale. So it's on the ground. So they'll be passing. And I think that's going to be Cole Hansen passing in for Wauwatosa West. All right, it wasn't Cole. I had the wrong name there. Again, Kai Rogers trying to drive in, and he's got two guys on him. Wow, stolen by. What's the hell? There he goes. Oh, almost a dunk there. Trying to drive out. That was filled miserably. Off the rim. That was, that was kind of funny because um, at the time, Owen Ustruck trying to take it in the hoop there, and it didn't work out. So now Cole Hansen grabs it, trying to find a lane. Seven-point game here. He makes a three here. It's a four-point game. So they need to do something. Wow, oh, he had an open shot. There. there you go. There he goes. Off the rim. No good. Saved. There goes Jake Hansen. Jake Hansen trying to find someone to get it to. Driving up. There he goes. Kai Rogers. No good. Puts it back up again. Five-point game here. 40-35 game. Well, with Tosas West screeching, the guy's got to play defense now. We're coming back on offense. Now we just got to play defense, he's basically saying out there. To the pass to the left side, looking, driving up. Out to Steskunas. Steskunas is open. Steskunas takes a shot. Good! 43-35 lead. <clears throat> Sorry about that again. Cole Hansen looking. They can't beat West Dell. It's kind of funny now. Why would Tosa West? Oh, there's a foul there. Kai Rogers was fouled there. Why would Tosa West is coming back? But at the same time, Nathan Hale is starting to hit their threes as well, which is a problem. 
for a while with Tulsa so West because they're trying to get back in the game here. Stes Kunis now, I think he's starting to start on fire here. First shot is made there by Kai Rogers. It is now a seven point game. The Trojans still trail by seven. <clears throat> Second shot by Rodgers is good. It is now a six-point game. 43-37, West Dallas Hale lead. Taking up now the course, Danny Stiskunas. Stiskunas looking for somewhere to go. Dumps it off. There goes Robert Peters. Oh, he wanted that shot. You could just tell he wanted it. Nice shot in the corner. It is no good. That would have been a killer for Wauwatosa West. It rimmed out if he would have made that. Jake Hansen going up to the right side. And it's intercepted by Owen Ustruck for West Dallas Hale. Owen Ustruck trying to take it to Robert Peters. He goes, Robert Peters around, falls on the floor. Whoa, it went in two at the same time. He, was, he fell on the floor and still threw it up. Wauwatosa West being heavily pressed now. Under nine minutes remaining now in this game. Driving up, there it goes. Nice shot there by Cole Hansen. So now six back to six point game here in Wauwatosa. Seth Kunis taking it up. There goes Seth Kunis. Off the rim, no good. Jake Hansen got a chance here. You don't want to push the ball too hard here due to the fact. There goes Cole Hansen. Good! That's 41-45 game now. It's like that. This game's getting close. That's what we like, though. We like a close game. <clears throat> Driving up. Looking. Oh, in the corner. There he goes. There's number four. No good. That was missed by Marcus Rathel. While we're West trying to get a shot up. Oh, was he fouled there? No, he was not. He looked at, there looked like there was a little grab over the head there, but it was not called, so it'll be out of bounds and it'll be hail ball. So passing it in now is to the left side. Come on, get him a get him a man here. Robert Peters to Stes Kunis. Two ultimate players on this team. There goes Peters trying to drive up. Peters fighting through, and he's fouled. Never mind. Jump ball. Yes, it was a jump ball, so the possession will go to the Wauwatosa West Trojans. This game's getting close, I'll admit that. That's what we like, though, like I said before. Out to Cole Hansen, he goes. Cole Hansen trying to drive here. There goes Cole Hansen. Up, uh, no good. Just off the top of the rim. There goes Robert Peters now. And timeout, West Dallas Hale. We'll see you in 15 seconds. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Wauwatosa West High School. That is the first time I did not take a sip of water yet, which is amazing to me. Conference battle here in the Metro Classic, which is huge, if you ask me, because this is a big conference in the western part of Milwaukee that we do have to watch. 
Stas Kunis will rebound it in. I should say inbounded. I said rebound on accident. I got to sit on the edge of my seat for this one. This one's a big game here. Out to Roman. Out to Marcus Raquel. There goes Stas Kunis. Heavily guarded. And a foul committed. They call on a timeout? They must have called on a timeout. Teams are huddling up, but I'll stay with you on this one. Let me just grab my slice of water real quick here. Full timeout. I'll actually go to commercial break. Now it's full time. Max Preps is America's source for high school sports, and we're looking for more broadcasters out there that have an interest in providing live audio from their high school events. No experience needed, but it can be gained. Welcome back to Wauwatosa, Wisconsin, this beautiful, nice Milwaukee suburb. Hosting on many different things that are neat. Wisconsin Lutheran College, Briggs and Stratton College, Mayfair Mall. All these different things in Wauwatosa that you could come see. Housing great sports programs too with Wauwatosa West and East High School as well. Inbounding it in for West Dallas Hale. Stes Kunis out to Marcus Rathel, back to Siraj. Gives it back out to Rathel. Back to Siraj. Siraj looking away to get in. There goes Stascunas. Back for the three-point line. No good. That is rebounded by Tyler Bozell from Wauwatosa West. Bozell looking some, to give it to somebody. Out to Owen Smith now. To Hansen. Back to Owen Smith. There goes. I said Jake Hansen was just open there too. Tyler Bozell gets it. Back to Hanson. Got to find somebody open here if you're one with Tosa West. They're holding on the ball too long. That's never a good sign when you do that. Too much pass around. They don't look like they have a good plan. Gave enough here to take it. There it goes. Kai Rogers. Good. Two-point game now here in Wauwatosa. 45-43 laid. Hale still has a lead. Nearly now. So now there's going to be some players coming as well. There it goes. Robert Peters. Robert Peters heavily guarded. And it's intercepted there. Got a chance. Got the numbers beat. Oh, off the rim. How did he miss that? That's going to be a foul, though. That was Cole Hansen going up. And he missed it. He had him beat, too. That was a foul on Robert Peters as well. So now shooting two is Cole Hans Cole Hansen with a tie to tie this game. Yep. First shot goes in. It's good. Here you go. Cole Hansen's second shot is good. We got a tie ball game here in Wauwatosa. Here goes Stes Kunis. You can tell he wants to take it up. He's taking up the hoop. He's ready to shoot. You can just tell. Always. There it goes. Stolen. And. Timeout taken by Wauwatosa West with 529 remaining. Here's a 30-second timeout. We'll be back with you in 15 seconds. What's up, everyone? Thanks for listening in to Game Mike. Action should resume as soon as your broadcaster is ready to go. This is Game Mike. Max Preps is America's source for high schools. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Wauwatosa West High School. We actually got a tie ball game here on our hands. 45-45. West Dallas Hill led by as much as 10 at one point. I know, actually, I think they led by 12 or 13 at one point. Now I think about it. But still, 
what a game we have on our hands. We have a better finish coming up, I can already tell. So Wabatosa West will have the ball. Taking it out now back to Cole Hansen. Cole Hansen got to look for someone. Back to Moses Long. Back to Hansen. To Moses Long he goes. And Cole Hansen goes. Good! Wauwatosa West has their first lead since 2-0, 45 Exactly what they needed. Stets Kunis takes it up. Nice steal by Cole Hansen. Taking it up. And it's nearly dropped by Jake Hansen. To his brother he goes. Out to Moses Long he goes. There you go. Tyler Bozell. Moses Long. Come on. There goes Kai Rogers. No good off the rim. There goes Stes Kunis. Oh, just rimmed out. We almost had a tie game here. Back to Cole Hansen, he goes. Dribbling around. There goes Kai Rogers. Two. Hansen! Jake Hansen puts him up by six now. Well, with Tosa West up. <clears throat> if you're Hale, I don't know how you're feeling right now. You're up by 13 at one point. Now you're down by six. There goes Stes Kunis. They need to make that off the rim. It's going to be a, quite a finish here in the last three minutes and 38 seconds we have left here. Take it up. Here we go. There goes Hansen. Hansen looking for another way. And while we're toasting, what's it? Here it goes. There he, Off the rim. Oh, slam! Kai Rogers. What a slam dunk. Puts him up eight now. There it goes. And he's fouled. Tyler Bo uh, Actually, no. Siraj Solman was fouled but for Hale. But let's go back to that slam dunk we just witnessed. <clears throat> Boy. Surprised I have not lost my voice yet in this one. I'm trying, ladies and gentlemen. I'm trying. Seriously, I am. I'm not a play-by-play -play guy on a normal night. I'm trying. There you go. First free throw is missed for Hale. They needed to make that. So Sarah Solman misses the first free throw for West Dallas Hale. Ladies and gentlemen, look out for me tomorrow. I'll have a scoreboard show on tomorrow night, 6.30, 8.30. I'll also be trying to maybe go to one of the wrestling regionals in the area as well tomorrow. I wrestled one year in middle school, so I do know the sport somewhat. There goes Jake Hansen. While with Tosa West, they get a shot here and make like a three-pointer. It's that's, that's not good for Hale, I'll say that. Gives it up to Tyler Bozell. Tyler Bozell takes it up. No good. Rebounded by Stes Kunis. If you're Hale, you need to get some moving now. Owen Ustruck gives it out to Siraj Salman. Salman trying to take it in. Back out to Ustruck. That is going to be Donovan on the floor. That's going to be rebounded by Hennings. <laughs> But there was a foul on Cole Hansen, so they're going to call a foul on Wabatosa West. So Robert Peters will sub in for Nathan Hale. You got to get moving if you're Hale. Oh, what a steal. 
Kai Rogers steals it. He slams it, but it don't count. I think there was a foul called before. Kai Rogers, I think he's had about three slam dunks tonight, which is insane. Stas Kunis looking to grab it up. All right, that's stealing. Stolen by Kai Rogers. Back up to Hanson. Hanson going to shoot. No good. You got to move if you're Hale. Wilson Share with the rebound. One in the corner. Stas Kunis. Three. Five-point game now. Under two minutes remaining. Just under two minutes now. There's going to be the foul game playing now. There goes Hanson. He's going to run around hoping that he doesn't get fouled. Trying to drive up it was number 12, Kai Rogers, and he's fouled with a minute 47 remaining in this game. Robert Peters is fourth foul. He's in, he's in foul danger now, if you think about it. He's their biggest man on Hale. One more foul committed. He's done. Out to Hanson. What are you doing? If you're Hale, you got to start following soon because you're down by five. You also got to see what Wabatosa West is going to do. I believe they're going to fall here any second. No, they did not fall there. It honestly did look like they were going to. Passes in. Out of bounds. Stays with Wabatosa West. You can hear Hale's coach like say, tell him, "Hey, you got to get moving here." And that's going to be thrown out of bounds. That's going to go to the, that's going to go to the Huskies. It's going to get real interesting because if the Huskies go down and score, it's either a two or three point game. Wilson Shearer will sub back in for Nathan Hale. Passes into Sescunis. Sescunis looking to go up here. Stascunas driving in. Stascunas is going to take it out. And out of bounds it goes. It'll stay with Nathan Hale with a minute 16 remaining. Passing it in. It's to Wilson Scherer. Scherer trying to drive up. Gets it back out to Stascunas. Stascunas deep three. Good! 53-51 game now. Nathan Hale cuts it to two. You're going to have to fall. And Sharon did commit the fall with a minute one left. Wilson Shearer will commit his first foul. And now you got to hope while with Tosa West, he then misses both of them or makes only one out of two. I, yeah, so it's a one-on-one -on -one right now, actually, because it's not a double bonus, I don't believe. Yeah, they just said bonus. So if he misses the first one, oh, man. You got to make this or you're all with Tosa West. We're being in trouble. The shot is up and it's good. And he'll shoot another one. You can hear the thumb taps here at the gym. The shot is good. Jake Hansen comes up clutch, making two out of two free throws. There's a timeout. We'll be back in 15 seconds. Hey, everyone. This is Chris Rivas, co-founder of Game Mike. Thank you for listening in. Game Mike was built so any school, any program, any sport, any time can create a live audio broadcast. We believe audio brings moments to life. Download Game Mike today in the app and Google Play Store.
Thank you to the 17 of you that are listening right now on Max Preps. 55-51 game here with a minute and one second left. Wauwatosa West leads, but let's talk about earlier. Nathan Hale led by as much as 13 in this game. Now. Now. Wauwatosa West in the lead. Wauwatosa West needs this game, though, to stay up top with Sussex Hamilton in the Greater Metro Conference. So now you gotta you gotta hurry if you're so Peters has it now. Back to Siraj Solman. To Peters. Peters gonna take a three. Peters no good. It's gonna fall out of bounds. I think it's gonna stay with Hale. Yeah, it stays with West Dallas Hale. With 42 seconds left. Hale's still trailing by four. And that's going to be thrown up to Steskunas. Steskunas got to shoot. Steskunas hitting the threes today. Coming in quick. Out two. There he goes. Oh, no good. And there's going to be a foul come in with 29 seconds left. That was rebounded by Wauwatosa's Kai Rogers. So at the line, shooting two is Tyler Basil. No good. If you're Hale, you got to hurry up. You hear the coach yelling, go, go, go. Stas Kunis gets the rebound. Stas Kunis going to pull up. No good. It's going to be offensive rebounded by Hale. If you're Peters, you got to shoot. Peters, no good. Another offensive rebound by Hale. Oh, no good. Another rebound. Shooting up. Good! With six seconds left. One point lead only for Wauwatosa West now. Four offensive rebounds. Four offensive rebounds for Hale. They're finally able to get a three point shot off. So it's 55 54. Timeouts are formed. Hale's going to be falling right away. They're definitely going to have a chance to come down and hit a game tying shot or a game winning shot potentially. Six seconds remain on the clock here. Holy moly. We got one on the hands, ladies and gentlemen, tonight. <clears throat> Let's talk about this greater Metro Conference, though. Western Milwaukee, like I mentioned earlier. Got people dancing in the crowd here. People are excited. I Probably a... A Hale fan, or else maybe in West Dallas, I'm a Wauwatosa fan. But wow, what a shot there. Four offensive rebounds. And <laughs> that's all, I mean, wow. Four offensive rebounds. Puts up the three, they made, missed three, three threes. Three threes before then, missed them. And they finally throw the fourth one up and get it. So they're still trailing by one, Hale is. There's a foul right away. Leaves five seconds on the clock. Wauwatosa will be shooting automatically. Saraj Sulman commits the foul. Shooting at the line right now is going to be Cole Hansen for Wauwatosa West. I'm going to predict when, if and when the West Dallas Huskies get the ball back, it's going to go in Stes Kunis or Peters' hand. That's just my prediction. So Cole Hansen will bit the line to shoot. It's in the bonus right now. Yeah, so double bonus. Actually, no, it's actually the normal bonus. So he makes the first one. It's a 56-54 game, five seconds remaining. He'll get another free throw. But don't I do? Miss it on purpose. I, actually, no, no. Because you think about you want the three-point lead. Because <clears throat> they can just call a timeout to get the rebound. The shot is made. Timeout called. 57-54. I'm going to drink some water so I can give you the loudest scream if a game-tying shot is made. 15-second game break. Are you a parent with multiple active kids? Are you at one event while your spouse is at another? That's where Game Mic comes in, the free app that allows anyone to broadcast live audio so that people can listen on the go and feel as if they were there. Game Mic. It's in the emotions.
Thank you all tonight for joining me on the Max Preps audio stream. We have a heck of a game on our hands here. 57-54, West Dallas Hale is trailing with five seconds left. West Dallas Hale will have the ball. This ball, I will predict, will either be in Stes Kunis or Peters' hand. Wow. West Dallas Hale led by 13 at one point. Then Wauwatosa West got up by 10. Now Hale down by three. What a game we have on hands here. What do you do, though? Really good question here. I'd like to see what they thought of here. This is going to be really tight here. Trying to find someone open. Rodgers takes it. Rodgers, you got to shoot. No one able to shoot. No good. That'll do it while well, Tosa West hangs on and survives. 57-54. That shot was missed off the right side, considered an air ball there. But still, what a hot Hard fought game here at the end. Wow, well, Tulsa West goes on to win 57 to 54. I'm gonna take a quick game break and I'm gonna recap this for you all.